Good morning, I'm Jonathan Selby. I'm here in Reynosa, Mexico. All right? Not long ago, I'm an independent missionary. Okay? Not long ago, I come from seven years of work in Asia. I come from seeing people in Palestine and Jordan having been displaced and pushed out, homeless, thousands of them, okay, over in Jordan. Can't go back, no place to go. I come back to America, and now I see right here the same situation of stranded people caught in a situation where they don't know what to do. Okay, um, let me show you uh, what I'm doing. I, I've traveled here in my van, and I have uh, set up a, a base uh, from which to uh, help feed and, and do my music. But the main thing I want to bring your attention to is uh, what's going on here. So let's take a walk around here a little bit. They call me here, uh, Awela Johnny, and they are my nietos. Am I saying it right? Nietos. 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 And uh, so when I'm talking, you can frame over to me slowly. Yeah. And uh, so uh, in the Philippines, which I spent oh a number of years sailing the islands, they called me Lolo Johnny, and they were my apos. So now I'm a well Johnny and they are my Niatos. Okay. This is where they pay money uh, to do the laundry over there. Okay? Okay. <laughs> Hi. 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 And I guess here they can wash the dishes, yes? And here they can have uh, some food cooked, okay, and they can get water. Can they get water anytime? Okay, so I have a young man who's assisting me whose English is pretty good, and his name is Gonzalez, and he's going to help me uh, translate. One of my favorite students. Favorite students. What? What is this? Oh, hello, you Hello. Hello. So this is uh, like a main tent. They got a, a whole bunch of people like under this one here. But there's um, thousands of tents all close together. This is about a quarter mile, no, yeah, maybe quarter mile block area. Oh wait, there's the main, where's the main kitchen, Gonzalez? Main kitchen? Oh wait, there's a bigger, bigger kitchen. Uh, okay, maybe we find it later. Hello! Hello! Is that a kitchen over there? Yes. Yes, I think that maybe that's what I'm thinking is the big kitchen. Hello. Hello. 
Ola. I'm going to give you the same Ola now. Hello. 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 Where the bathrooms are where? Over? Yes. Yes. Oh. Lovely episode today. Okay. Now I'll see a little bit. Can, can I... Hola. Morning. Uh, there are not many people here now. But sometimes, oh my, uh, like in the evening, uh, you don't want to have to go quickly because usually there are lines here, way out, uh, long lines, okay? But these are the restrooms for the whole place. This is like the main kitchen over here. And most of the food is free. It's donated. It's it's not government. It, it's not from the U.S. Uh, uh, nor is it uh, from the Mexican government. Uh, food comes in from uh, non-profit uh, non-profit organizations. Gonzalez, where is my buddy? Okay, so let's see if we can engage in conversation. Okay, so you can maybe translate uh, for them. Hello. So, you, principal person here. No, No. Well, this is my translator and my cameraman, both here, Gonzalez. No, español. Okay. So, uh, I want to uh, talk to some uh, family for them to tell me about their trip, okay, and how it's been. So let's. Uh, uh, okay, uh, ask them if uh, let's just find a family, shut it off for a minute. And it's on. Okay, I've uh, found a few people here uh, willing to uh, tell me about what they've been going through. Okay, so um, what country do you come from, Dan? Honduras. So she's from Honduras. And how long did it take you to travel here? Two months. Two months of travel. Much sun, much heat. You have children? Which? Just two of you. Oh. You from Honduras? Honduras? Guatemala. <laughs> so they come from many countries, months of travel. And uh, what do you hope? What do you think will happen next? Do you hope to get to America or you might have to go back? What do you expect? <laughs> you want to get into the United States. Have they have they offered as Mexico or to just send you back? <laughs> Waiting for asylum. Asylum seekers. Okay. And, and you uh, you hope to get to America also. And you've been here two months also? 
So sometimes the problem is getting a lawyer and getting papers, yes? That, that is the problem is that they don't have the money for the lawyers to get the papers, the file, and so they do not know how long that they're going to be stuck in this situation. And this is the circumstances for these couple thousand people. Uh, well, I pray blessings on you all. If the Lord would open the door and so find the way to a better way. Thank you very much for your gracias for sharing.